4029 News, they've had a power line down in their yard for three days. 4029's Jonathan Roselle shows us the damage. He's live in Fort Smith. Crews just finished working on this line right above me. Now, this huge branch fell on it Wednesday. Now, it's a line that runs from the main line on the street all the way to the house. Now, the power company says it's not dangerous, but they want it to get it fixed. I don't know. I get anxious over it because kids and all that. His yard has looked like this since the storms blew through on Wednesday, and he's afraid to get near the line. The family says they've called OG&E for two days to get the line looked at, but no one came until this morning. The power company says the line isn't dangerous, but needs to be taken care of, and they hope to do that tonight. OG and E says they have about 300 employees working on problems like this just in the Fort Smith area and getting the power back on in other areas. Live in Fort Smith, Jonathan Rosell, 4029 News. The power company is hoping to have all the power restored to the River Valley by tomorrow.